Jetty Island as a thing, it actually started a long time ago, over a hundred years ago now. Um, they built the jetty, it's man-made, they built it solely to create a freshwater port for the city of Everett. We have the two mile long beach uh, that is the main attraction here. The giant mud flat that when the water comes in on a hot day is very warm. So that's 80% of the people who come on our ferry come solely for the beach. You know, there might be another group. They are the kite boarders. And actually I call them the jetty natives in most of my talks because they are out here just as much as I am during the summer, even more. The technique, I can teach you people like people who come yeah, You taught me that night and I didn't even have a Here at Jetty Island or at any other beach where there's kiteboarding, we're kind of one of the latest sports to arrive. So it's had to be a slow acceptance uh, as far as kiteboarding beaches go. Uh, Jetty Island in particular, the community here in the Northwest has been very proactive to uh, work with the parks department that is here and all the public and try to make a safe zone for kiteboarders to be and for other beach users to be. And we all try to share this big piece of sand. <laughs> Thank you.
pond has evolved and changed and uh, it is a gem that we put on our calendars for days that we know the water will be in the pond. The pond is basically a uh, flat water area that's sheltered by, the, by a sand berm with wind going over top so the water is very, very flat. So for doing freestyle tricks or advanced moves, um, it's a great spot for uh, those kind of guys that want to do that. I had a vision plain and true Saw something that few people do And Lord God, I think I've seen enough I had a vision true and plain That crack broken rusty ghost train That once you're on, you can't get off I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes On this train This train This train This train Old iron's bearing down like wind It's built by rune and run on sin It had no start, it has no end Every face, it looks the same No one can tell from where they came Nobody knows what's round the bend I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes, I saw their eyes Looking down from the train Through those busted window panes They were calling out my name, boy, your name
trying to get this last little like loop in there. Oh, can't quite get that one. Got it. Got it. It's an effort to get out here. So everybody's all kind of in the same boat. They had to get over here somehow. They're all over here set up waiting for this awesome wind to glow. And so it really bridges relationships. And then once we get the wind, <laughs> we're extra stoked and high five and off the water. And you know, the friends keep growing and the community keeps growing and so does the stoke. The question is, the question is, will we be here in the morning, standing up like mountains in the sun? Are we the ones to break down this machinery, to be our own technology, to bury bad news deep below the worm? The question is, the question is, can we reach our full potential? As a result, we've been accepted and now people come to watch us and they love watching us cruise across the water and how beautiful and colorful it can be. Jeffro BSing about the forecast for tomorrow. <laughs> that me, was coming. magic. It's that gonna happen. Was... It's gonna happen. That team, team, it's gonna happen. Was the highlight of my summer. That wow. right there. <laughs> Holy. Wow. Well, yeah. That totally I'm done. I'm good. I can go home oh. with that comment. <laughs> That was awesome! <laughs> oh, it's a tough call!
Tough call. The weather forecast good. looks possible tomorrow. Work on your tan, cause yeah. But who knows until no you wake up in the morning, this, everybody. So <laughs> just Boom. Be grateful. Bring your bikinis. Let's get some sun. Let's get some sun. <laughs> so what else did you capture? <laughs>